Ahlao sahla, welcome back. Today we're going to make a traditional Lebanese dish called fette. Don't be intimidated, it's super easy. First, we're going to grab a can of chickpeas. You can find these anywhere, and it doesn't have to be this brand. Drain and wash them. Add them to a pot along with two cups of water. Cover them and bring to a boil. Next, grab a mortal and pestle and add three cloves of garlic along with half a tablespoon of salt. This dish is meant to be garlicky, so just trust me on the garlic. The best part of a mortal and pestle is that it becomes your two minute therapist and it enhances flavor. If you don't have one of these, you can use the back of a knife to crush them and then dice them. Once it becomes a paste like consistency, like this, add to a bowl along with one cup of yogurt. I use full fat Greek yogurt so the consistency is thicker. Note that if you use less fat yogurt, the mixture will become looser. Mix quickly to combine and then add 3 tablespoons of tahina. This will add creaminess to the texture and a delicious toasted nutty taste. Mix again to combine and last, cut a lemon and squeeze half into the mixture. Depending on how juicy it is, you can use whole or just a half. Mine turned out to be juicy. Mix and the base sauce is done. Next, we'll move on to the nuts. Grab a lot of butter and melt it in a pan. You can use olive oil as well, but I like the buttery taste. I have some chopped almonds here and I'm going to toast them in the butter. You can use pine nuts, walnuts, or whatever nuts you prefer. While that browns, I'm going to drain the chickpeas and add them to the sauce mixture. You can add a little chickpea juice in there as well if you like the sauce on the thinner side. Mix until all the chickpeas are coated, and by that time my almonds are done toasting. I'll add them right on top of the mixture and hear it sizzle. Next, I'm going to garnish with dried parsley and chili flakes. We're decorating the Lebanese way. Add a drizzle of olive oil and voila. You've completed the most garlicky, buttery breakfast, lunch, or brunch. The sauce mixture is flavorful and creamy, and the toasted nuts add a buttery, crunchy texture. If you enjoy this video, please like and subscribe. It helps feed my lab rat.